Welcome to Inside Science TV. Everything you have ever touched contains matter, which has mass. That's basic physics. But understanding where the building blocks of the universe get their mass is complex physics. In Europe and the U.S., scientists have collided subatomic particles at nearly the speed of light to find answers. They think subatomic particles have mass because of the Higgs field. Now, the Higgs field is an energy field that permeates the entire universe. We don't know if it really exists, but we think it does. If it does, different particles interact with the field differently, and that's why each particle has a different mass. Since predicting this field in the 1960s, physicists have been trying to detect particles from it known as Higgs bosons. What the Higgs boson tells us about the universe is why the universe is here at all. If the Higgs boson didn't exist, subatomic particles wouldn't have mass. If subatomic particles didn't have mass, atoms wouldn't exist. If atoms didn't exist, you wouldn't exist, I wouldn't exist, nothing would exist. On July 4, 2012, international science teams announced conclusive evidence of a new particle resembling the Higgs boson. The discovery could shed light on how the building blocks of the universe all tie together and how our universe came to be. The universe is 13.7 billion years old and we can study all the way back to one trillionth of a second after the universe began. New clues on the physics of a weighty matter, helping us better understand our universe. I'm Josh Lebowitz reporting. Inside Science TV. If you enjoyed this edition, follow us on Facebook, Twitter, and YouTube. Powered by the American Institute of Physics and a coalition of underwriters.